if you want to stick around hi guys welcome back to my channel and today I have ding, Manny MUA's Life's a Drag Palette from Luna Beauty. Wow, look at that reflection on the camera. This is one sexy palette. And today, I'm going to review it and tell you what I think. But before I do it, I'm going to kind of go off on a tangent. I basically paid double to get this palette. And... It is my own fault, I have a story to tell you. If you wanna stick around and hear about my story, just because it is useful information in case you are from the UK and you wanna order this palette. If you don't, I will leave a timestamp in the video so you can just quickly skip on over to then and then you can just watch me swatch the palette on my face and you're gonna get close up and personal. So, what it was, I am a huge fan of Manny MUA. I was so excited when he got his palette. I couldn't wait for him to distribute it to our UK sites. So I ordered it from his Luna Beauty from California. Um, the only problem was it kind of cost me double. It was my own fault, I'm going to be honest, because I didn't read the full website. Now, from my ex personal experiences with ordering from the US, I have quite a lot of experience. So, to go into it, I generally thought I was being clever and basically just doing what I normally do. Because when I order from US sites, when it comes to the shipping, it says international shipping and then a price. Normally when I buy something, the custom charges are in the international shipping fee or it says shipping and customs. This time on Manny's site, it said international shipping. So me automatically thought that it's included like when I bought things off other sites what I've said that. In this case, it wasn't. It does say on his website, I will leave a picture of a screenshot what it says. Basically we are responsible for the custom charges now it is on his website but you have to look for it which is fine i just assumed because i've had experience with other websites what's said the same thing i just assumed it was included in the price so that is my fault now custom charges is when it basically gets delivered to your door and you have to pay the delivery guy a custom charge so i had already bought the palette i already paid 20 pound for shipping and then I had to pay £31 custom charges. And the palette is about between £30 and £40. So I pretty much paid double for this palette. Just because I didn't read the website. Because it is there in black and white. So whoever is watching this, hopefully you didn't skip it. And you want to order it for your kids or yourself. You know this information. It would have been nice to get a little warning, little box before you press complete my order saying if you're ordering outside of the US you will be custom charged on delivery. That would have been nice. I didn't see that, not that I know of. And then people are at me like, did you not read the terms and conditions? No one reads the terms and conditions ever. I've never read the terms and conditions in my whole life. I'm gonna now zoom you guys in to this face, sorry, and test out this bad boy and the, the it's dropped. Now, you've probably seen this on Instagram, on everything. I am probably gonna use like these colors and maybe a shimmer. I don't want like a dark natural smoky eye and then I might use like a pop of blue on my bottom, sh bottom, bottom. Are you guys ready for this? I might hold it this way. No, no, this way. Oh wow, okay. Okay. It blends out so nicely. I need new brushes, because these are just old and I Like I do clean them, but they're just old.
Oh wow. Oh wow. This is legendary. And this is bait. Now these two are amazing. It looks really, really nice in the mirror. On camera, it just looks not that nice, but it looks really good in person. Okay, so I'm gonna do some color under my bottom lid. I'm gonna, I kind of like, I used the wrong brush. Oh no, oh no. I'm gonna take Kiki and the bottom lid. So I'm going to take Fishy. Wow, look at that colour. I'm going to go and finish my rest of my eyes off camera and I'll be right back. So you can see where I've like messed up my eyeliner. I thought I would pair this look with my Kiss Me from Live Glam in Butterfly. I really like this palette. I did find it hard to figure out what I wanted to do, but that has nothing to do with the pigment in the palette. I really like this palette. I don't think it's worth double what I paid. It's definitely worth the price what it is online, but I I can't believe I paid double. It is nice to forget about the eyeliner because I messed it up, but the shadows are so pigmented. So pigmented. I'm definitely gonna try a few other things with this palette. If you wanna see more makeup tutorials or makeup stuff, let me know, hit the like button, click the subscribe button, click on the bell. There's so many things you have to do now just to watch a video. So thank you so much for watching guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye!